For many, the tension building between Russia and Ukraine are bringing back memories of a similar situation just a few years ago. Queen City News reporter Maureen Wirtz spoke with one Charlotte woman who lived right along the border before fleeing in 2016. Sometimes it feels surreal, picking up her little girl from school and teaching her the difference between two, two, and two. English is not my native language, and language is a big deal in your life. But when Anna Tarentiva thinks about where she came from, it's hard to remember that this is real. This is home now. I have a lot of like uh, problems with my like mental health, and uh, sometimes I still th uh, see some like dreams when I came back, and it's like the nightmare. Anna is Ukrainian and lived along the Ukraine border, just 30 miles from Russia, right where Russian troops are building up their forces. Of course, uh, my heart is still there because I have a lot of uh, relatives and friends that uh, I love and they're still there in Ukraine. They can't um, leave it because of some reason. In 2016, she fled the country, not just for her, but for her daughter, Marina. Some people say to me that we are like traitors. Though she was a lawyer in the Ukraine, she's a wedding photographer now, choosing to be there for the happy moments in people's lives. Hope that everything will be fine. <sighs> Nobody knows. I think that nobody really knows. She says hope is what brought her here, and hope is what she's giving to her little girl. In Charlotte, Maureen Wirtz, Queen City News.